everyone how are you guys today for me i woke up with a huge migraine this morning but it, i had an appointment for my car to get the recall done on my car so i was like okay whatever i'm just gonna go because if i cancel it this weekend i just won't want to do it next weekend and all that so i just decided to go that actually it happens a lot with with me anyway how like i wake up really don't feel like going anywhere but i have to Especially, I only have two um, two days completely off during the week. I just, I really push myself kind of hard. I think that has helped me get as far as I've come. Anyway, um, I still have a bit of a headache. I honestly think that it's probably, I haven't been drinking very much water this week like I should have been. So I think it's a little bit of dehydration. But I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update. I guess not really an update. I just wanted to show you guys some stuff and get a video up this week. I showed you before how I could go into the squatting position and hold it. Unfortunately, I still am using my phone as a camera and I don't have another timer. So hopefully by next video, I will have remembered to get myself a little timer to really show you guys. Anyway, today I just, um, I thought I would try to see if I could go into that position without like going down into it from because before I had to support myself from the couch going down into it and then no hands because I haven't figured out really how to get in that position um just from the floor so maybe I can figure that one out and I'll, I'll give that a try my legs are kind of tight today so we'll just we'll see how that goes but let's start with like the easy stuff for me kind of easy so with the balloon again because I still have all these balloons that I'm trying to get rid of and my long list of things to do is clean my room and first I need to get rid of several balloons. But anyway, so so you can see is this and then just squeeze each okay that did not work out together, but squeezing your shoulder blades together. I thought it would be cool to get the balloon to stay behind me, but that didn't happen. Um another thing is like this, put it in one hand up and reach up to it with your other hand. Whatever you can grab, it's a nice stretch. However long you can hold it and then switch. Kind of hard with your fingertips. I'll show you the front way of that one. These are all like just by the way to help with uh, like with me. Like today I have a headache, so to help with that. So back and forward. Back and forth. Of course there's always tossing up back and forth. So much fun by the way. You could try cooking it too. I um I just haven't felt like doing that one yet. Before I do the challenge, let's see. So I'm going to try giving this side into it and see if I can get there. So I'm on all fours and then just kind of rocking back. Yeah, maybe I'll try it the other way. See, I'm like, I'm kind of scared, I guess, to really go back. Do it from here just because I don't know why I'm scared. I just am. Maybe I'll try this. I come forward. You don't want to peek slip out too much to do it that way. Maybe. If I there we go. Yeah. Okay, well. So off balance, but I was able to get into it by like standing up and then going down without anything supporting me other than the floor. Um, like I said, I wasn't feeling good to begin with, so I mean, I'm sure that affects my body too. That's about it for today. I'm sorry about all these boxes. I am, um, like I said, I woke up not feeling good. I had all this stuff I plan to do, like these boxes behind me. Or from my pottery business, I was gonna do a lot of stuff with that, but didn't even 
get to it maybe tomorrow we'll see um but yeah and now all right let's see what the question is yeah, i'm getting better at popping these by the way and not and not completely um flinching but what is the worst gift you have received um i don't know how to answer that so i mean whenever someone gives me a gift i'm usually like very appreciative that they thought of me to give me something so i don't really i don't think there's a worst gift that i've ever received just because I appreciate that they thought of me. Does that make sense? But um, anyway, I'm sorry this video is kind of lame and boring today. But in a way, I think it's good that you guys see me on one of my days where I'm really not feeling that good. I'll post the link to my um, my poultry business if you guys are interested. If you have pets and you want pets, in um in the description box. And then also, this is the very first shirt that I made for my, um, like, t-shirt design business. I will post that link, too. And I think I've explained it to you guys before, but, like, each butterfly represents a part of how I feel with SMA. So, strength, courage, hope. I think it says hope. Oh, no, wait, hang on. Strength, hope, courage. Um, the butterfly first. My being there um just kind of scared and then going into like learning how to fly and then to really being free and flying um i used orange and purple as cure SMA colors and then blue and pink are just like two of my favorite colors together but anyway i'll post that link too and like i said i'm sorry this video is kind of on the boring side today Usually, I try to not have them like that, um, but if you'd like to see more, please subscribe, please like, or, well, or even dislike if you don't like it. I mean, no harm. You like what you do, and you don't like what you don't, so. Um, so, yeah, and any questions that you guys have, let me know. I'll be happy to answer them, and like I said, hopefully next video, I will have a lot more energy and be feeling a lot better. But like I said, I wanted you guys to see me on in like on an off day so you could get a feel for that too. So it's not like, oh, she's happy all the time. And yeah, I try to be, I try to stay positive. Um, I won't really say that I'm not happy. Well, I'm not happy that I don't feel good right now. I'll put it that way. It's not that I'm sad or anything. I just kind of don't feel that good. All right, guys. Um, that's enough for me, Rambling. Thank you so much for watching. As painful as that might have been to watch. And I hope you guys have a great week. And I'll see you guys next time. Have a great rest of your weekend. A great work week. If I don't get a video up before. Hopefully I might have time to do another one tomorrow if I'm feeling better. We'll see. Alright guys. See you next time.